Jackson trim my beehive diary. Um, just got myself a brand new bench hive and this one is available from B uh, Things. Um, so that's B Things uh, on Facebook and their website is bthings.co.nz. The hive itself is about a thousand dollars just for the hive and includes the frames or you can get it as a package which includes a few extra tools as well. So over here what you get in the package is your bean fowl so it includes the hood with a nice little mesh thing to go over your shoulders as well. You get your uh, hive tool which goes through and scrapes off all the wax etc and also to help take the frames out or your hive as well. Um, your basic uh, bee smoker, put it up with uh, leaves, twigs, whatever you need and you can use it to uh, make your smoke from the bees. Other items I got was a bee brush so you can brush your bees off um, the frames when you're collecting it and uh, the capping fork so you can go through and um, take samples of the brew take the caps off your honeycomb when you're ready to harvest. The other ones I've got are two of these um, bee feeders. Let's see if you can get it inside. Um, it's all ripped on the inside so the bees can climb down, get their sugar water etc without drowning and then climb back up. So these go in the hive and they replace two of the frames that are normally inside. And we'll move on to the hive now and give you a quick uh, going over of the hive. So what I liked about this one is that one it doesn't look like a hive so any uh, body that's walking around the street um, they won't recognise that it's a hive and that means they won't uh, moan and groan or try and lay complaints uh, even though you're legally allowed to have two hives on your property uh, where we are. And it does actually look quite nice compared to the old square ones that most people have. The other good part is that it's flip top so it opens up and everything's about waist height so you don't have to worry about trying to bend over and lift up um, the top of your hives. When your hive's full of honey each of those boxes are roughly uh, 50 kgs or so, so they can be quite heavy for some people where this one here is a lot easier for me to lift up as well. On top you've got two aluminium sheets and that's a stop um, the bees going through and laying wax etc on the top and physically um, gluing the top of the lid down so you can't get to the frames inside. Inside there's 28 frames, these ones are plastic, you, it will take the wooden frames, this one came with plastic frames, I'm not too sure what the difference is between them, however when you read up online some people go on that plastic frames are not as good as the wooden ones, um, or you can get a combination of wooden frames with the plastic foundation. So on here you can actually see it's got the imprint of the honeycomb on it already so the bees can go through and lay their uh, honeycomb over the top and yeah. So I'll just see how it works um, from the company they said they've got no worries about bees laying on it and quite a few people have used them as well. Uh, so there's 28 frames in this hive. Um, which when you go through and work out how much you need for the bees so it's around about six frames for the brood which are all the babies and then you need another say um, six frames for the honey for them to have over the winter so they don't starve when it's cold even with me putting in um, the sugar water to help them survive they still need a few frames just in case uh, so that still gives me a good, um, say, 
12 to 16 frames that I can use um, that are going to be full of honey and each frame is around about 9 kgs uh, once it's filled up so um, the frames don't weigh that much at the moment but when they're full of honey they should actually weigh quite a lot um, looking for my first season they reckon you should get around um, 16 to 18 kgs of honey depending on what the weather's like and how well the bees actually go and from there onwards you can get anywhere um, from 35 plus kgs um, in each season after that because the bees don't have to go through and make their honey again so they can uh, make their honeycomb so this is the hive um, it's quite good the whole package as I said before um, just under 1300 includes the hives, plastic frames and the smoker and the bee valve etc. I did have to go out and get myself another valve um, because my arms couldn't fit through the opening in the mesh but it's quite good um, as a backup as well. Uh, my bees will be arriving later on so my next video is going to be about me getting the bees and putting them into the hive and yeah we'll see how it goes.